when they soak up a little culture. I feel I owe it to Sheridan. Well, I haven't enough time. There's plenty of room if you'd care to... No, thank you. <laughs> I think I'd better wait here in case my husband telephones. It's nice when they telephone, isn't it? Richard always telephones me when he's away, and Sheridan rings me continually. When was I away? Have I ever been away? I don't remember the precise occasion, dear, but I do remember that you telephoned. Funny, if you'd have asked me, I'd have sworn I'd never been away. It feels like I've never been away. <laughs> Richard. <laughs> Our regards to your husband when he rings from the Far East. Tell him we often ask after him. I will, Hyacinth. Thank you. Things like, why doesn't he come home more? <laughs> Is there a marriage happy, do you think? Oh, good Lord, yes. He lives abroad most of the time. <laughs> Home more often. I don't suppose he's formalizing. It costs money. When he does come home, I do hope he won't be riddled with tropical ailments. For the first six months, we'd have to be very aware which glass he drinks from at my candy <laughs> lunch. Drive very slowly past number 23. I wanted to see my aunt.